Hey everyone, today I have a quick Windows 11 tutorial for you. We're gonna be showing you how to set your primary monitor in Windows 11 or how to set your main display. My setup consists of one monitor right here in front of me and another one over here on the side. And the one in front of me is currently set as my main display. So games automatically pop up here. My clock is in the corner with my notifications area. This can be kind of frustrating when I want it to happen over on this screen. So today we're gonna to show you exactly how to switch your primary monitor here in Windows 11. But if you are new here, my name is Ken, and this is Northern Viking Every Day. We bring you videos on reviews and how to's, so please consider subscribing so you don't miss out on any upcoming videos. Let's go ahead and dive right into Windows 11 and show you how to set your main display. All right, so here we are on my Windows 11 desktop, and you're currently seeing the screen that's right in front of me here. And this is currently set as my primary monitor or my main display. So when I load up a game, it automatically loads up on this screen, or you'll see my clock in the corner here where notifications will pop up on this screen. And I wanna switch that over to my other screen that's over here. So it's really quite simple to do in the settings here in Windows 11. So the first thing we need to do is find an open area on our desktop. And we need to go ahead and right click with our mouse, not left click, but right click. And it's gonna bring up a little menu that looks something like this. And in this menu, we're looking for the option. It's right here in the middle. It says display settings. You can go ahead and left click on display settings. That's gonna bring up the display settings here in Windows 11. So you'll notice your monitors up here. I have two monitors. If you have three monitors, a third one would show up here. I have number one, I have number two. Number two is the one here in front of me. If you're not sure which monitor is which, you can go ahead and click on identify here. And a number is gonna pop up in the corner of each screen so you can identify which monitor is which. Now, a quick pro tip for you, I have a lot of people asking me this. They say my mouse extends off the wrong side of the screen to get to the second monitor. Quick fix right here, you can actually move these screens around so they're in the correct order. So if you want a screen above, you could easily move it above or off to the left-hand side if you want them in a different order. Just go ahead and hit apply here and it would switch the order of your screen so your mouse extends in the same direction. So I'm gonna just leave it like this for now. So currently you can select either of these monitors here. We wanna go ahead and select the monitor that we would like to make our main display. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on number one and I'd like to make that my main display here. And right underneath it says multiple displays and there's a little drop down here. We can drop that down and in this area, you're gonna see it's there's a checkbox that says, make this my main display. Now, if I go back over to number two, it's already checked off because that is my main display. So we're gonna go back over to number one and we're gonna check that off to make this my main display. And it automatically did it for you there. So now when I minimize this, all of my icons have automatically switched over to my right hand monitor here. Now, if I'd like to switch it back, I can just go ahead and right click on my desktop again. I can go ahead and left click on display settings and go back into here and I can select my second monitor again and click on make this one my main display under multiple displays and it'll switch the left screen back over to my main display. And it's really that simple to change your main display or your primary monitor here in Windows 11. So I hope this tutorial was able to help you set your primary monitor here in Windows 11. If it did, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Also remember to connect with me on social media. You will find all those links below in the description. Thank you so much for watching today and until next time, take care.